If I was to summarize the Hello Stranger experience in a word, I would say it's unexpected. Agree ako, Tony. Unexpected love at an unexpected time parang kwento talaga na save me. Today we're looking back at how love brought us here and how love is going to propel us in the future. Ito ang love letter namin sa inyo. This is Strangers No More, The Making of Hello Stranger. Tapos nangyari yung in-expect ko. Ano? Sabi ko, either ibubully mo ako or mahihiya may hiya ka sa akin. Hindi ako na-awkward. Hindi ako na-awkward. <laughs> na-awkward to siya. Pag nasa ano kami, pag may mga cheesy lies kami. Kasi una pa lang, Chi. Ano na yung ano natin? Diba? Huh? Hot dog. <laughs> What do you love most about Hello Stranger? Um, everything? I mean... With one of my favorite Pinoy BL series called Hello Stranger. Hello Stranger has been a really... <laughs> An amazing show. It's kept me on my toes. Oh my god! Happy <laughs> Savior, I'm getting getting moved. Hello, Stranger has it all drama, comedy, romance. Tricep, <laughs> tricep, come on! It's a series you grow with. You grow and learn as the characters grow and learn. I hate this. No! No. No. Why would you do this? Siguro kami in Black Sheep, the reason why we were so excited about doing a BL series is because we've been noticing the rise of a BL audience. Well, itong Hello Stranger, it really came unexpectedly. It was also unexpected how the thigh BL craze really exploded during the lockdown, during this pandemic. And it kind of paved the way, you know? It kind of paved the way into making this this project happen. Of course, you know naman Black Sheep, di ba? We've always wanted to innovate in terms of content. So, because of this, naisip namin, if this is the kind of content that this market wants, bakit hindi tayo gumawa ng BL na sariling atin? That's very Filipino, di ba? In terms of sensibilities, kung paano ma-inlove ang mga Pinoy. Suddenly, I was being approached by a past collaborator, si Patrick Valencia, from Black Sheep. After Peter said, said yes to the project, uh, what followed were endless meetings, endless brainstorms, endless writing, and giving feedback. So, madugo talaga siya. And ayaw din namin to gawin unless you were confident with the material and the story we wanted to tell. And biglang, finally, parang it came at the right time. Parang this is the right timing to do it. When we were thinking of the main characters, si Xavier at si Nico, we actually already had someone in mind for Xavier. And it was none other than Tony Labusca. Alam mo kung bakit pinakpan ko yung camera? Kasi nakatingin ako, nakita ko yung sarili ko, sabi ko, hindi ko kaya tingnan yung We really couldn't think of someone who could play Xavier, this cool, happy-go-lucky varsity sports guy ng school. You just really had to see him and there's that impact, eh. there's that oomph na parang si Xavier yan, gets mo agad yung character. I was so scared, pero excited. And um, wala eh, to be honest, akala ko mababash ako ng malala. Sanay naman ako. <laughs> so sabi ko, 
bahala na wala na akong pake kung mabash ako. Pero, gusto gusto yung character ni Xavier. Very open-minded siya. Can you stop overreacting? Hindi ako OA. Grade ko yung nakasalalay dito. Gets mo? Okay, okay. Wow, can you just relax? Chill ka lang. As for Miko, we had a series of auditions. First time din namin gumawa ng casting call that was all done remotely. You know, like people would just shoot themselves with their phones. I'm Jason Gandra. If you sift through all these audition clips, there was just really a standout. And walang halong bola to. Uh, from from the get go, I already saw J C Alcantara for the role of Nico, just because he was really the only one who aced that audition so perfectly that, parang just Nico just came to life when I saw his audition clip. I need you. Huh? What? What was that? Ano yun? I need you. Okay na? Umamil ka? Ano yung naramdaman mo? Natakot ka doon. Natakot ako. Kasi, alam ko si Tony, daring scene yung ginagawa. The glorious guy. Sabi kong ganun, binasa, pinanong naman sa akin yung script. Sabi niya sa akin, sobrang light lang talaga na. Pero parang hindi naman light. Iyak ka ng iyak dito. Ay! Oo, bakit? Hello! So, first day ng live shoot namin for Hello Stranger. Meeting each other for the first time. It has its own thrill. So, I'm here to witness all of that. Nakakamiss mag-shoot. Sobra, sobra, sobra na exit ako. Tingnan niya. Sorry. Ay, bakit pala dito? <laughs> Ang ganda lang din na yung story din naman ng Hello Stranger is about these two boys who unexpectedly meet virtually and and yung experience si Tony and JC for each other. Parang they also get to know each other virtually. And 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 yung yung parang siguro yung energy na yon parang nata-translate naman on screen yung yung tension, yung yung excitement of having a new friend and all that. Magkano ano? Uh, kondo. <laughs> Para ha. sa'yo, may discount. Oh, oh. Ang tingin ko talaga kay JC is parang baby boy na baby boy talaga. Um, <laughs> sobrang tahimik mo. Nahihirapan ako nakausapin ka minsan. Uh, pero ngayon, okay na tayo. Kasi guys, kung hindi ko siya nakausapin, wala siyang may ibibigay sa <laughs> So, uh, sino mag a -adjust? Mukhang ako, di ba? <laughs> Grabe pa lang siya yung tawag. Oo? Nahihigilay sa inyo sa ako. Yung totoo. Oo, oh, ikaw bahala. Alah sya. Oh, okay good. Sweet yang sobrang sweet nato. Eh, iba. Oh. Di ko masa sabi kung sweet tau. Kau lang makan sabi nanti. Sweet tau sa. I love the super insane killy chemistry between the cast right from the beginning. That's like my absolute fave. Our favorite ship would have to be the friendship between the Padawans. Yes, it's phenomenal. The bond that they had is so unreal. I think na unang nagmeet yung barkada for the first time. We 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 found the right mix when when we saw them together in in one barkada scene. For me and Patrick, when we were creating these characters, it was always important for us to build this story of friendship side by side with the love story. And when we were creating these characters, uh, we wanted them to be real and relatable. Na kahit ikaw may isip mo na may kilala akong Kukay or may kilala akong Miko sa buhay ko. No? So parang feeling mo, kakilala mo na rin tong mga characters na to at na-meet mo na sila somewhere. And sobrang importante nung, nung glue nung barkada dun sa, dun sa series.
Wow, matchy matchy sila. Tapos yun si Junjun, that mix of humor, but also this this wisdom na sa kanya lang pwedeng manggaling. It landed on Mix Almendras. I think yung energy din ni Mix na parang I guess his experience in theater para laki nung ang laking bagay nung nung you're just one with your castmates and all. Um, when I found out that I got the role of Jun Jun, syempre I was happy kasi automatic yun parang sa akin, uy may trabaho ako, ang saya na may trabaho ako. Harap ng kain ko? Ayan, breakfast or lunch? Breakfast. So na-excite ako doon, pero may moment din, medyo weird yung feeling kasi wala, hindi man lang yung traditional na na form, nasanay tayo na on set, on location, parang ano ba yan? Makakatrabaho ko yung black sheep kaso ganito pero sige okay lang, masaya pa rin Arat na! Ang galing din kasi parang despite not having seen each other or having spent time together, you know, in, in person, which is important no, to have that chemistry as friends itong meron sila as virtual buddies Nag-create din siya ng magic kasi parang yun din naman yung setting nung, nung series. Ayun, gumawa kami ng group chat. Nagawa namin ng paraan yung chemistry namin. Doon kami nagpulitan. And kahit sa mga shoots namin, hinayaan kami ni Direk na mag-interact talaga with each other. Kung kahit na wala na sa lines, sige lang, magbarahan kayo dyan, mag-ano kayo dyan, mag kayo dyan. Oo, ganun. We had the lovely Vivery and, and Patrick Kiros play Seth and Kukay. For me, I'm just really grateful talaga na meron akong project with V. Ako, personally, message ko si V. I call her sometimes para lang, you know, para lang malight yung relationship na between the rapport, kumbaga. Si Patrick, I always remember him telling me na, Direct, you have to guide me. Kasi first time kong gagawa ng ganito. Ganito meaning uh, a romantic story. Hindi ko na realize na yung balakid talaga in in really achieving this this killing uh, from Kaisef was they were acting kasi facing their phone cameras. Hindi nila nakikita yung isat isa. So ang mga ginawa namin exercises sabi ko okay sige. I think for this to work, kailangan maramdaman nyo kung anong nararamdaman ng Kaisef kapag magka video call sila. When when we first, when we did that for the first time. Sobrang nag-work yung scene, like like talagang nag-chat din sa akin sila Alem, yung mga producers na hala nakakakilig sila Patrick at Vivory. Tapos si Patrick din na feel niya. De, pero seryoso talaga. Thank you. Kasi nandiyan ka. <laughs> kinilig din ako. <laughs> Wait lang, kinilig ako ron vibrate. Ewan ko sa iyo, bahala ka diyan. Kakat ko na to. Oh, I need you to stop looking at the camera now. I cannot <laughs> stop. What I love about Hello Stranger is that each like support role actually serves a purpose in getting the story going. Hi, Crystal. So, si Crystal kasi, pati hindi siya magmahal. So, gusto ko rin i-balaman ng people na si Crystal, hindi lang naman siya yung kontrabida. Sobrang love niya si Xavier. There are uh, people na kagaya ni Crystal na kayang tanggapin yung decision ng mahal niya. Kumbaga, kung saan magiging masaya talaga yung love niya, yung taong mahal niya, susuportahan niya yun kahit masasaktan siya. Hindi, pabalik na hindi ka manhit. Gusto ko yan, gusto ko yung mga ganyan-ganyan, sige. Oh. May mga tinitweet sila na nagagalit sila kay Crystal, pero hindi sila nagagalit sa akin. Gets nyo? Parang wala lang, nakakatuwa lang talaga sobra. Uh, Miko. Yan lang pala eh. <laughs> sobrang swerte ko nung naging part ako ng project na to kasi sobrang saya makatrabaho ni Direk Peterson. Honestly, halos dream come true na rin siya because I love working with like this 
new era of young directors. Um, they bring such a different flavor to the to the game, to the industry. Hello. <laughs> 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 Uh, one of the nicest director that uh, that I that I be able to work with, and sobrang cool and uh, smooth lang talaga, kasi he really wants the best for us and and nakafocus talaga siya. Cakay support ng binibigay niya sa amin, 100% talaga. Magandang ginawa mo kanina na bumawi ka na ng phone alam. Bakak pa di mo sabihin niya nakakadawag ha pag nagphone ka. Ah, okay po. Parang defensive, parang ganun. Oh. Yun nga, sabi ni Lapat kanina, sobrang cool na director. Kasi bata pa si Direk, ba? Diba? So talaga nakaka-vibes, vibes lang siya, ganun. Tapos, pero work kung work. Collaborator siya, kumbaga, nakikinig din siya sa amin pag may sinasuggest kami. Tinutulungan niya rin kami. Nagtutulungan kami dito. Sobrang saya niya katrabaho. <laughs> sabi ko, <laughs> nung describe ko yung kiss, <laughs> Kasi nandito yung mukha niya sa tabi ko. Sabi ko, parang naglilin in na tong isa. Pwede na natin yung gawin. Pwede na natin yung gawin. Malapit na malapit si Mila. Sarap ng feeling. <laughs> Actually, at first, I wasn't quite confident. Parang, how, how are we gonna do this? We're not going to see each other face to face. Lipat sila sa recording device nila kasi ang, ang gagamitin nating footage dito ay yung sa Zoom recording. Yeah, she's gonna like. We kind of, you know, built a system where uh, we ask the actors their their extra efforts to, to really help us pull off the, the production requirements. There was really specific Zoom meetings for all the aspects of production na kailangan ayusin bago mag-shoot. We're kind of proud of that. Kasi, kasi despite the situation, despite the unfortunate circumstance that, that we couldn't do the things we did regularly before, uh, may nagawa pa rin kaming produkto. I really, really love the production value of Hello Stranger. As in, that's the first thing that I noticed when I watched the show. The cinematography, it's like when you're watching, it adds dimension to the show and it makes you feel that you're really part of their world. I love very particular filming styles, very um, different, very uh, unique filming styles. Good night. Ah! Ito yung isa sa first time ko may experience na parang lalo na sa mga nagre-react, nagte-tweet, uh, nakikipag-interact uh, sa amin. Ito yung first time ko na sila din yung inaabangan namin. Inaabangan namin yung mga reaction nila kasi yun din nagpapasaya sa amin. Um, hindi kum kumpleto yung araw ko kung hindi ako nakakapanood ng reaction videos nila. I watch it while I'm going to sleep. Oh my god! Ah, this is way too cute! No, I'm sorry. Stop these shots! I'm going to get a little bit of 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 a little in the comment section, in the reaction videos. Miko! Bawal yung black sheep! Ano ba yan? Walang ganituhan! Miko! No, 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 no. It's crazy. I mean, who knew na DL pala yung magpapa international? Who's on top of my mind, Shavier? I have been more interested in Filipino food, and I'm trying to see if I can make something, especially pancit, if I pronounce that correctly. I think the one thing I appreciate about Hello Stranger, it it made me enjoy your humor, Filipino humor, because y'all are really funny, and I love that. Hindi naman po ako tap. Tap ka, Miko! Tap ka! Talaga po? Ako? Tap po ako? Yes! Okay. Ang 
bigat. <laughs> Alam niyo naman ang sitwasyon niyo sa mundong ito. This series help a lot of people is their pain even though a little pain. Ang daming napasaya ng series nito. So for that, I'm really, really thankful. Uh, nung na-release namin yung episode kung saan nag-out si Miko dun sa mga friends niya, and may nakita akong tweet na in particular na nagpapasalamat siya sa amin. Like, tinag niya kami, tinag ni Black Sheep, tinag niya ako, tinag niya si JC na finally, uh, nagkaroon siya ng lakas ng loob para mag-out din sa, sa friend niya. And dun ko nakita yung pwedeng maging effect ng show na na nakaka-empower talaga siya. Hin like, lumalabas yung, yung epekto ng show in real life. Sexuality isn't the issue with it. It's normalized. And I feel that's very, very important to the LGBT plus community is that it is seen as a normal thing because being gay is normal. And I really like that that's how it's perceived in the show. Love is love at the end of the day. It shouldn't be about sexuality or it shouldn't be about gender. But the truth is, Savior really does undergo uh, transformation with, you know, when he realizes his feeling for Miko. And I'm sure it's somebody else's story who might be going through something that's similar. I want to give it justice for the people out there who are looking up to Savior or admiring Savior and Miko's story. Because for them, it's really important, you know, so... I think that's why I cherish this so much because I know it's important for someone young out there. Because for the longest time, there's been such a big demand for the LGBTQIA to finally have their stories told and not just them be the sidekick, you know, not them just be the comic relief. Aking historia yun ni, aking historia yung Hello Stranger. Kaya lang, ang nangyari, wala akong mga friends. Wala akong napag-share ng nararamdaman ko for 27 years. Na, nasa puso ko yun. At um, hanggang ngayon, hindi ko na ilalabas. Girlfriend! Hi, yeah, yeah. Group hug naman dyan! Group hug! I wanna be in on this group hug. <laughs> the Young Padawan's friendship reminds me of my friends. Uh, they are very good friends. They've been supporting me. Uh, through my ups and downs. What I realized when you're making this this online show is it's it's also building this online community. And you feel that we're building this, we're creating this safe space for each of us to interact, para para mabigila lahat natin yung mga frustrations natin sa buhay, mga minanasa natin sa buhay. Uh, ang fun lang, ang fun lang mapanood at makinteract, makisale dito sa 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 virtual space na to and and i have nothing but gratitude for all of our supporters i like hello stranger because it's light um it's enjoyable and uh to be completely honest ako personally sobrang kinikilig talaga ako kay Miko cha kay Xavier it's refreshing to see to watch a series like this every week, you know, my wife and I, even my daughter, we look forward to it. And right when it's on on YouTube, we're we're on it. We we sit down all together on the sofa, on the couch, in front of the TV, and we just our eyes are glued. You've all seen how Save Me's journey is. Uh, they built this unlikely connection. Na parang these are two lost souls. These two people trapped in their own homes, trapped in their own selves. We've seen their friendship blossom. Uh, nakita nyo kung paano sila mainis sa isa't isa at ngayon parang hindi na nila malet go ang isa't isa. For the finale, we wanted to tie it up all together at, at dito natin makikita kung saan nga ba talaga hahantong itong, itong unlikely connection na to. Oh, this finale, listen. Give me something good, all right? Cause I was dead, honey. <laughs> I was you don't want much hair. So please, I hope for good things. I hope they get into a relationship. You know, that's what I'm hoping for the finale. So don't let me down, Black Sheep, baby. I have no idea how the finale is gonna turn out and I'm so scared. I don't have any theories, I don't have any thoughts. I only have hopes and my hopes are that it's gonna be a nice and good and happy ending. Fingers crossed. Three teams saved me. This is the finale. 
this. And this the this finale. better be the finale. <laughs> There's no other black way. Black sheep. Black sheep. I heard that black sheep likes to give sad endings, and if there is a sad ending, I swear. Even though I want Nico for myself, I mean, I just want them to be happy. Sa akin naman basta happy ending yung makakatulog ako ng maayos. That's it. Hindi ako wala akong mapapaligid nito ng masama. We just really wanted to make a finale na na ikatutuwa nyo at 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 and you can't help but but root for save me. Root for all the save me's in our lives. Sige na. Bawa na na ako, Savior. Bye. Bye? Hindi ba takits? We're really not ready to say goodbye kasi ang feeling talaga ng relationship namin with you guys para tayong naging isang malaking barkada. Parang feeling ko lahat tayo naging part ng Young Padawans. Sobrang ramdam po namin yung pagmamahal na binibigay nyo, yung pagtanggap sa amin. Maraming 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 salamat at sana patuloy nyo pa pong supportahan yung Hello Stranger. Sana huwag nyo kaming kalimutan. It has been a pleasure to be your Jun Jun and thank you so much for that. Sa totoo lang, thank you is an understatement sa lahat ng suporta na binibigay niyo po sa amin. Kayo rin yung uh, inspirasyon namin dito and maraming maraming salamat sa pag-umahal niyo sa amin. Yung sobrang thankful namin sa kanila kasi simula una hanggang dilo sinusuport na nila kami. Alam mo yun, sobrang nakakataba ng puso yung pagmamahal at support ang binibigay nila sa amin. Kaya, thank you! 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 Hindi ko naman sabi. Ngayon, we really couldn't have done it without you guys, di ba? Kasi itong project na to is online. So, kung hindi dahil sa inyo, hindi namin magagawa ang Hello Stranger. So, maraming maraming salamat. Thank you. Kasi, Tony na pala, no? Thank you, Tony. Kasi, so, alam mo yun yung friendship natin. Sana, mas tumagal pa. Sana, mas maging okay pa tayo sa susunod. Na shoot? Na shoot? Na shoot. Sana mag-comment tayo. Salamat sa'yo sa pabaitang pinakita ko sa akin. Mm. <laughs> thank you, thank you sa sana mm. magka-trabaho pa tayo. Mm. And maging okay na sa video. <laughs> <laughs> Paano ba ito? Siguro... Ah, okay. Unang-una gusto ko sabihin na sobrang proud ako sa'yo. Kasi sobrang galing mo dito. Hindi, mas magaling, magaling ka din dito. Pareho tayo. Hindi, tayo. pero gusto lang sabihin na uh, at first kasi hindi ko talaga nakita na magiging bagay tayo. Thank you na tinanggap mo yung project. And siguro wala din akong maisip na ibang tao na gusto kong gawin tong project na to. Ngayon na nagawa na natin siya. So, Salamat na nabigay mo yung lahat. Uh, nakita ko naman sa sa project na to na binuhos mo talaga lahat ng kung ano meron ka para sa project na to. So, maraming salamat and ayun, sana magka-work pa tayo and sana mas maging close pa tayo. Sana kausapin mo na ako. <laughs> Tarits. Tarits. <laughs>
So book your tickets at atx.abs-cbn.com. I love how versatile you guys are. Oh, And cut. Perfect yun, guys. Thank you so much. Look. 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 Sobrang pula mo, JC. Picture tayo. One, One two, three. One more. One, two, three. Hello, Sheetmate. Wanna hang out with me? And me? Aliga. Just go to the Black Sheep YouTube page and click subscribe. Then make sure you click the bell button. Ding ding ding! Ganon! Don't be a stranger. See you there.